One of the biggest stories from this year's ski test has been sustainability. It's been really, really difficult to achieve a sustainable ski because of the combination of materials packed in there and how they're all fused and sewn together. This year, however, we've seen some big steps forward in the construction and manufacture of skis that is changing that for good. The first major sustainability story is brought to us by Rosignol with this, The Essential. Their approach to sustainability is to produce one of the first recyclable skis. This has been achieved by doing away with the resin that bonds much of the ingredients together and replacing several elements with wood, such as the top sheet and the sidewall. All you have to do is simply drop the ski off with Rosignol when you're done. They will ensure that 77% of the ski is recycled and only 6% of it goes to waste. A nice cruisy ski to ski, but with enough edge hold that when it, the conditions start to go from under you, it'll stay with you the whole way down. At the Ski Club, we love this approach to manufacturing skis and we hope to see more of it in the future. Rosignol have helped us along the way by making the recipe open source, meaning manufacturers can get a hold and make their own sustainable skis more easily than they ever could before. The other approach that manufacturers have taken is to replace some of the materials in their skis with something slightly more environmentally friendly. A good example of this is Dienstar with their brand new M-Cross range. They've replaced the metal core so familiar to so many skiers with a sheet of wood and removed all fiberglass from the construction of the ski. That has led to a 60% reduction in materials consumed and waste produced. It is a massive step forward. Understandably, Dean Star don't want to sacrifice performance of the ski and produce a second rate product as part of this. So what's really refreshing is that this is a ski that skis really, really well. That wood core is nice and poppy and helps you on-piste and off-piste, demonstrating that you can make those changes without sacrificing the performance of the ski. These steps are not going to change the world overnight. They won't make the seasons longer and they won't make snowfall more predictable. But it's a really important step in the right direction to attack one of the last bastions of unsustainability in the industry. It's a fantastic step in the right direction. Thanks so much for watching. We'd like to send a huge thank you to our sponsors, Snow and Rock, Husky and Ovo Network for all their support in making these videos possible. Check out links in the details below and more information on the Ski Club website.